Yeah. <laughs> this is our Rona on wheels. <laughs> oh, shit. But, yeah, so, I mean, uh, if I can say something to everybody out there, if you're going to go out, and I fully support everybody going out and doing your whatever, live your, live your fucking best life, but if you're going to go out, even if it's not mandated, just put a fucking mask on. You know what I mean? Put your mask on. Is it 100%? No, it's not. But is it better than nothing? Yes, it's 100% better than nothing. Yep. So just put it on. It, it sucks. It's uncomfortable. But guys, come on. I got a fucking big-ass beard. I, I get it. I'm I'm 100% on board. It's uncomfortable. It's hard to breathe. It fucking sucks. Donkey balls. I get it. But just put it on, you know? Because. And if you don't want to put it on and there's no mandate, then at least do at least keep your distance. Stay stay six feet or you know, or away more. from everybody. If you can do more than great, but if you if the least you can do is six feet, stay six feet. You I'm know telling what? you. Put, uh, me I go Mandalorian. Put on the fucking mask, you know, and uh because this is the way. Well, some places, you know, don't have the mandate, so... I know, uh, but be be courteous, motherfucker. I mean, you know, I'm just saying. Uh, eventually, like I said, hopefully we'll get this shit under control. I mean, sounds like the vaccine is coming pretty quickly. I know here in North Carolina, they're already prepping for how they're going to start distributing the vaccine. Yeah, Pfizer came out with uh, one that is like 90%. And then, of course, uh, our government, whatever the heck they're testing, uh, we don't know who's, who, what, when, where. But I, I see the little Facebook ads already where they're asking for volunteers and you can make up to 1200 bucks. And I don't know. We'll, we'll see how that goes. Yeah. But, I mean, uh, it, it, it's obviously a step in the right direction. Right. And if you're one of those that are not going to get the vaccine then i don't know i don't know i don't know how they're going to work that out i don't know what the deal's going to i don't know what's going to happen like i said uh a hundred years ago the spanish flu was a little bit easier to control because we didn't move as fast as we do now right we didn't fly all over the fucking place i mean now i mean even fuck even in vehicles i mean it's crazy we're we're all over the place well, like in Florida, Florida governor just came out and said that he's not going to be issuing any mandates. He's not going to be shutting any schools down. He's not doing any of that. Why not? It's fucking Florida. We, in fact, uh, I, right. I was listening to the episode uh, yesterday at the, the really good show. Somehow Florida came up and we were all cracking up. Yep. Because why not? Florida has to be Florida. So it is what it is. Uh, uh, I don't know. We got the vaccine coming out. Uh, and, and I, I'm pretty sure what's going to end up happening is the people that have the vaccine and, and it's just going to start slowly. Where even if you don't get the vaccine, it's still going to be wearing the, the virus down to a point where I think it'll just fizzle out. Well, yeah, but that's a, that, that's a couple of years down the line though, especially, yeah, I think especially the way we're going. I mean, like right now, everything is spiking up right here. Like I said, I have my mom in the hospital. I can't visit her. Right. And well, especially now. Uh, but um, it, it, that's some crazy shit. Uh. Yep. Anyway. Oh, so, do we got anyways, anything? just wear your fucking mask. You know what I mean? Like, just fucking do it. Yeah. Seriously. Do we got anything else? Anything? Okay, we talked a little Mandalorian. We talked truck driving school yeah uh, <laughs> i wasn't expecting talking about truck driving but hey it's what's going on um, hey well hey it, 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 it it's like i said i can relate to it because i like i said i did it for a while because back in the day i um i, I don't now every hey uh, one thing let me ask let me ask you uh the the dot book that you're supposed to keep now it's electronic how, how does that work uh or did they, it well, work? I have, I downloaded it, mm-hmm. um, but I also printed it out because I'm old and it's easier for me to read it <laughs> on paper. Oh, so, um, so they're using like an app now? No, it was just a download. No, like, I'm ta- uh, uh, like WordPress a WordPress file. 
you, you know what I'm talking about. How many hours you can drive? How many? The, oh, the logbooks. The logbooks. Oh, oh, yeah. Okay. yeah, the logbooks. So those are still paper, um, but they said mo- like we're using the paper ones for um, learning only purposes. because. Well, no, they want us to use the paper ones because DOT regulates that. Even if your company is using using the electronic ones, if that system goes down, you have to be able to show what you've been doing for the last seven days. Oh, makes sense. Oh, so, 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 so the log paper logs are still in circulation. Yeah. Yep. Oh, I, yeah, I thought I thought everything had gone paperless. I mean, you know, a lot of the companies advertise paperless logs and stuff like that, and I was like. It, well, how yeah, you most of to... them do, and you don't even have. Even if the system goes down, you don't have to fill it out in a log book. You just have to have it be able to show where you've been. You know, yeah. let's say you get pulled over and the system goes down. And you're like, oh, so the system went down, but I've been keeping track of where I'm going and where I've been and how long I've been there, and and here's my list. And uh, it'll be you know populated once the system is back up. And they said most DOT uh, officers are okay with that. Hmm. Well, I guess we're changing with the times, but I'm like, yeah. how you can't, but how can you cheat now? How can you run two logs and make any real money? Cause I mean, seriously, uh, that, that, that can't happen no more. Uh, that's what I'm and saying. Most, most fun- trucks will shut, the, will shut down. I after heard, so long. I heard that they can do that now. Yep. That, yep. They will, they will start beeping, telling you got about 50 miles left or however long. Start looking for something. Start looking for Find a place me someplace. to to either go to sleep and for the night and then you got the 32 hour reset if you're over the road where you got to shut down for 32 yep. hours that oh god that's I crazy. think it's 34 now 34 uh, I got I, yes 34 or 32 I can't remember like I yeah. said that was 2004 yeah. 2005 and I did it for a short for a few months cuz uh like I said I missed the kids it was crazy. Yeah, I'm not going over the road. I can promise you that. Yeah. I, I'm going to do local or I'm going to end up doing like buses or dump trucks or something like that. And yeah. <clears throat> that's just until I can get into normal school and, you know, do more with normal school so I don't have to work hard anymore. Well, hey, sounds like a plan. And yeah, I'm just not going to stop. I'm I'm going to continue to try and learn and. You know, I think that's that's what we all should do. I mean, it, it, life, it's a continuous process. We, we're never really done. You're only no. done when you say you're done and you give up. Yep. And that's not going to be me because that's not who I am. Well, hey, man. But other than that, that's about all I got. All right. Well, that's cool. It's good to, like I said, it's good to talk to you, bro. Like I said, I really need to. It's good to hear your voice. I, I've been missing you. I, I miss the hell out of you, too, bro. I was like, <laughs> hey, you know. And like I said, this is, uh, we're all going through shit right now. And I'm sure you people listening out there, they're going through stuff. Uh, I hope we took you away from it for a little bit. You know, we didn't at talk, least a couple of minutes. I hope uh, we didn't talk about sex robots. We didn't find any nasty perverts in Florida sucking your toes this time, but uh, we'll be back with Give that. It time. I'll find something. Oh, okay. <laughs> we'll, we'll find something. We'll, we'll be back with that. So motherfuckers, motherfuckerettes, thank you for tuning in as always thank you for allowing us to have the time that we needed to get everything situated um i like i really wanted to do an episode but physically i just i i couldn't do it i couldn't catch my breath enough uh i wouldn't be wouldn't have been able to to continue talking for the entire length Um, makes sense no i'm glad you you're feeling better and like i said uh we're we're gonna we're gonna continue and We'll be back. Yep, and just keep going bigger and better. All right. Hey, uh, it's it's almost we've almost been doing this for three years. In a few in a in a few weeks, it'll be like yep. third anniversary of cursory motherfucking overload. Thank you for right. tuning in. As always, we love you. Well, yep. I'm glad that we're all glad to be back. And uh, you know, uh, don't forget, as I always say. You know, just go out there and, and, and it doesn't cost you a fucking dime just to be nice to somebody. Yep. And, and nowadays, it's fucking 2020. We, we've we got to step it up. We've got to be nicer to people. Uh, and, and because it, it all starts with, you know, you. you. You're the one that starts it. Yep. Um, it, so. It all starts with you. In other words, I'm right. talking to the man in the mirror with me. That's with right. You. 
All right. Well, you guys have a good one. Thank you for tuning in. Yep. See and uh, take care. Later, motherfuckers. Later. <laughs>